Hello Gothic friends, so that's my name. Welcome back to the world's let's play of the world, Gothic 2 Liber Edition Harko. In today's episode we are going to explore the library, the old library. We got apparently some sort of key from one of the orc shamans, yeah. In front of the uh, scholarly library, so. There are some powerful monsters inside, I believe. Yeah, the demon, this is a new thing. Oh boy. They make su such weird noises. Okay, this was opened. But this one wasn't. Complicated. Finally, ah, oh, nothing important in here. So, we always go to the left when we explore something, apparently. So, we will go left. Oh boy, that scared me. There is a demon into the back, apparently. We are hitting that or we are aiming at that. Nothing to be had there. Nothing to plunder. They were quite nice placed. Very close to the entrance. Oh, we almost one shot them. The guy's snoring. Why are they demons? Do they really fit the gothic team? And they have no loot, nothing. nothing. There. Ooh, forgot about you guys. Nothing to plunder. So, sarcophagus. Priest shield. Ooh, okay, this is new. Might be quite a good shield, right? Priest shield. Ooh, 75 strength. Okay. Nothing for us. The stronger the the shields are, the worse malus they have. Uh, this is needed to summon Quar Hodron. Some of the information. Gold coins, not a lot of gold coins, only 17. More gold coins, more gold. Nice. So, the left side is already cleared. Not so expanded. Not a lot of stuff to be had here. Oh, wow, look at our healing. 1 HP. Be full. That was quite perfect. Now we have to pull. Oh, now we throw away. Okay. The key was needed for this. Another demon. The snoring is... Weird that we don't uh, wake up the, the demon with all the noises. Weird, weird noises. Quite scary. Not sure what to take. What to think about it. Oh, the noise, I mean. Yeah, there is the story. It's quite hard to, to read it with this font anyway. The story about the builders of the, the old, the ancient guys. Ah, that was it, okay. Nothing to be had there. They have nothing important for us. We got a ring. We have to read those because we get information plus the experience. 150 experience is quite okay. Okay, guess that's it with it. What did we get out of here? Oh, 
essence of spirit, okay. Last three, we are going to use it anyway. Ball lightning, yeah, those are not great for damage. But they might be needed to, to pull away orcs from packs and stuff. So we can go out, right? There is nothing more to explore. Did we get everything out of here? Looks like we got everything. So now we can go to the pirates and earn ourselves the, the armor. Because we cleared everyone. The canyon is completely cleared, the beaches are completely cleared. We only have to go to Malcolm after that and do the stunt jump. And look for the Malcolm. Yeah, the Malcolm is gone, the Owen is going to be there. And after that we will go to the mages and they will tell us to search the buildings, the old buildings. So I believe we are going to explore the buildings before we go to the the bandits. I think that would be the smartest way to go about. Because once we are the bandits then we can simply just keep advancing and advancing. We can kill the mind crawlers. That was a big concern to me. But I would think that the mind crawlers would pose quite a, a threat to us, to the bow. But apparently, we have a lot of dexterity, like for real, a lot of dexterity. 164. How much do we need for the bow to be able to damage the trolls? 150. We are quite close if we start uh, eating the dragon roots. The problem is the king sorrel, yeah? We don't have any of those. And without the king sorrel, we cannot actually learn the strength or the dexterity. So I, I'm really still thinking about it. We don't have to worry about trolls. There is only one that's going to pose a threat to us. <laughs> when we want to talk with Quarhodron, he's going to block the cave, but we might be able to sneak in. Greg, our good friend. About that canyon? Yeah, what about it? It's done. I killed all the razors. Good. You seem to be a useful fellow. I know, thank you. I need that bandit's armor. Hey, you're quite something. Bones was supposed to wear that armor and spy on the bandits. But maybe you're the better man for the job. Perhaps you even stand a chance of coming out of there alive. Talk to Bones and let him give you the armor. Then put it on and go to the bandits' camp. I need to know why those scumbags came to our valley in the first place. I will learn about it. Oh, I like the way the, the pirate's camp got to reshaped. So, Garrett, hey, I don't you. know, do we need more money? Uh, Show me... Not sure if we really need more money. But we can empty our inventory a little bit. The orc axe we sell. Oh, we keep. But the rest we sell. Don't forget to keep the pickaxe. Time. Is it really true? He simply needs to practice more. This I don't think we are ever going to be able to wear, but we keep it just for fun. The fire bow we don't need anymore because our bow is just the same. We cannot craft any of the fire arrows. Yeah, we, we cannot craft any of the fire arrows, so it doesn't matter to us. We can sell a lot of those stuff, but we are going to hold on to when we actually need money. The warrior we keep, might need, but the rest, uh, the fire we don't need protection, strength we need. The sets we are going to keep just to be sure we get all of them, that we don't need because we have a plus 5 and plus 4, so this is not needed. Mana bonus plus 5 and mana plus 10. No, we don't need that anymore. The strength one is this one not. Light wounds, we don't need that. 
Yeah, yeah we are selling what we don't need. I used to say that myself. Greg's logbook. I don't know about those notes we might keep on the two horns, that's good. Fuel box. I don't know what the skull is needed for, probably it was useful for something, but not anymore. Focused on oof. I don't know if we did it in the canyon, we will check later. The rest we are going to hold on to, right? Just standard stuff. Oh, the sextant that we need for our guy in the thief skilled. You hardly know who to believe these days. What else? I've got no time for things like that. Sulfur, yeah, we are going to hold on to that. I know if we can sell this. The ring we can ah oh, the necklace also. I'm no better off myself. Oh, we are so rich now. Eh, been there, done that. Holy water, yeah, that was needed for some so we are going to hold on to everything else. Did I see we had some lamps? Tiny clam. Pearl. Nothing there. Another pearl. Oh wow. Twelve gold. Nothing That's there. nothing, so we have to get the He simply needs to the armor from bones. That's really not my the pirates are safe. Bones give us that hey. armor. It is going to be so weak, just watch it. Watch You're it. supposed to give me the bandit's armor. Orders from Greg. From Greg? Whew. I already thought I'd have to go after all. This spy job in the bandit's camp is nothing short of a suicide mission. I'd rather have Greg keep his chores on me than get myself killed by those bandits. The armor? Oh yeah, right. Here it is. Just be careful. Those bandits are a bad it's lot. It's medium? Medium? Probably 25. Yeah, forget about it. As I said, we could have worn the Dragon Hunter's armor if we bothered to save uh, the guy, the Bennett from jail, but not yet. I want to enjoy this armor because normally nobody really plays with this, as I said. It comes at the wrong, wrong time into the story. It would be a lot stronger with the Dragon Hunter armor, but as I said, we don't really need it. So practically we know we could tell Malcolm that we delivered the message, but he's not going to be here, right? Yep, nobody's here. Luckily we know where they could be. There are some lurkers down there. Oh, he was sitting on the ship. How's it look? Again. Who are you? Are you one of the bandits? Do I look like one? Yes. Ah, judging from your clothes, you've come a long way. So we stole now all of the pirates. As I said, the loot is What's very up? good, but the experience is even wor more worth it. One of those filthy lurkers attacked us, so we fled into this cave. But that lurker came after us. Malcolm fought with it, and then they both fell into that hole over there seems to be full of water. The Lurker and Malcolm continued to fight down there for a while. Then it went quiet. I have a no good idea friend. whether he's still alive or not. How do I get down into that crevice? It beats me. You can either climb down or jump, I suppose. Jump then. How, how do we know Your that he's Malcolm dead? Is dead? I thought as much. Poor devil. Should have helped him after all. And? If I had known all this in advance, I'd never have become a pirate. So I believe the way that we know that he's dead because the game actually acknowledged as soon as the... He has normally a stone of one hand or two hand or something. Tablet. And... Because in this version they got removed, the game uh, assumes that we looted it and we have seen that he is dead. That's why we can tell Owen that his friend is dead. That's my only explanation. Because he doesn't have that in the inventory anymore. And the guy should be still here, the, Mal the Malcolm. And the lurkers, they are enjoying their dinner. 
Ooh, that was perfect. Yeah, Malcolm is there. So as a, again, the guys that have the old coins on them, we cannot look them. Pass look them. The mod doesn't work on them. There are some rock crystals if you actually need here. If you are a mage, or probably if we need them in the future for some. Ah, and sulfur a lot. Rock crystal, yeah, there they are. Where are we on the map? Oh, we are here. Ah, gold. So we have this mod that we can actually use to see if we loot everything that usually I do off screen. After we clear an area, like simply just go and collect all the loot that there is. It makes it is no fun to to just watch me, for example, like now just keep looking where that item could be. So we see that there should be something. Here, for example, should be something, but it's not. Maybe it's above, so we have found Mal Malcolm. Let's go out. Then on the way to the pirates, not the pirates, the magicians, we have the cave with the shadow beast and some stuff there. We will tell the mages that the pirates gave us a pirate armor. Where are we? Oh, right. Here we cleared everything, I believe. Shouldn't be anything up here, right? Nope, nothing here. Very good. Maybe the, uh, a goblin up there. Normally, sometimes the goblin spawns when we advance some sort of a part of a main quest. Yeah, not this time, okay. Oh, there is the spot that we have to clear. Lots of goblins are going to be here. Oh, the warriors are here also. We almost one shot the warriors also. Yeah, we got a lot of... The guy went inside, I believe, right? Nothing to be had there. Nothing there. Yeah, and as we use the mode, the, the fast loot, we don't really hear a lot of nothing there. Normally, you hear nothing there quite a lot. Wolf skin? Did they skin the wolves or what? So, the arrow bug. Everyone should know it by now. We hear the shadow beast, it's not like the snoring of a demon. Okay, three shotting it. We will have to kill all of them in Corinus. Before the fourth chapter, as I said, we have to explore all the caves. Because later on something is going to spawn into those caves and we are going to lose the experience of the native monsters. And we don't really want that. Oh, a longbow was here. And some money, yeah. Money-wise, we don't really need any for the time being, but later on we are going to need a lot. This is the third or the fourth treasure that we uh, I think I found something. Oh, fine longsword. Okay, what did we get? Fine longsword, not so great for us. The bow, oh, the bow is quite good. If we wouldn't have what we have now, it would have been quite quite good, the bow. But we have a our own crafted bow. Which is very strong. So now we can actually go to the mages, tell them, or just go and explore the directly the other canyon part. Yeah, probably I'll go to the other canyon part, and then we will talk with the mages once we know everything about whatever we can find. So I believe here is another way, right? 
Yeah, it is, but it's the middle po uh, point of it, so. Oh, some treasures here. Lots of mushrooms in the add-on world. Oh, yeah, you can see a lot of plants. I really don't know if there, is, there are actually recipes for food. But it looks like there should be. So, as I said, we will talk with Omi just later on. We can learn some bits of it, we can go to the bandits, but it doesn't matter because we do have to, to have more stuff to enter the temple once we can. We will have to spend some episodes there into the bandits camp. There are some missions, quite a few of them. Can you please jump up? Of course you cannot. Or you can, never mind. So another treasure. What could be here? Uh, I think I found Only something. a gold chalice. Unbelievable. Greg, you were quite cheap on this one. So this is the only way to go into the canyons. Through here and then you will have the other two roads to take. Oh, a potion? Why would there be a potion? Oh, an orc. So the orc... We are not going to hit it from here. Two of them. Yeah, kill it, please. Perfect, thank you for your cooperation once more. Ah, their weapons, yes. Just in case you guys are immortal. Two orcs at once. Luckily, one of them got scared or something. We hear more rats. Womp rats. Oh, that's very good. So, we always go to the left side. We will keep the same tactic. Go to the left. Little bit of saving wouldn't hurt anyone, I believe. Womp rat. Yeah, I believe here is one troll. That can could piss us off. Oh boy, lots of plants. Lots of plantly. Snappers, yeah, the troll is up there, look. Yeah, stop missing, please. Cannot really afford us to miss. Yeah, we see nothing. Luckily, we are so strong that we can one-shot them. As I said, the plants and stuff, I'll just come back here and explore them. Out here, we are about to find another new enemy. Can we please hit it? Oh, so nice that we hit it. I believe we didn't lose any experience. Let's see if there is any of them on the ground. Nope, nothing. I heard a weird noise. Guys down there bring something, it's a golem. Do we deal damage to them? Let's check it out before he kills all our experience. 
So up here we will come after we deal with. Actually, we said we will do that after we come back. Mid bug, mid bug. Yeah, we will do that later on. Where is the guy? Did he kill all our, all our experience? Yeah, looks like it. Damn it. Kill the mantis. And it is gone. Is it down there? Did he kill another? No, only that. Okay. We still have no acrobatic, even though we have 164 dexterity. That's quite crazy. Wouldn't be bad to... Oh, there are some stuff up here, I believe. Yeah, there is something. Port axe and the potion. Where could the guy go? A stone golem. Oh, zombie. Okay, nothing here. What the hell, we hit that guy from so far away. Sometimes the arrows reflect of the deflect of the zombies, the the armored ones. Nice. Sadly, they deal so little. Uh, they give so little experience. Yeah, see, it deflects back. Just die, please. Does one of them have any keys or something? No, I don't believe. We shall see. I like the sarcophagus. This is such a nice addition. Like, it totally makes sense. There is something inside there. Yeah, found it. So, do you have anything on you? Nothing there. No. Okay. I believe one, some, some of them have some keys or something. Silver ring on stone tablet. Grape moss, okay. That's needed for those new potions where we need skeleton stuff. Did we loot everything? Yeah, looks like it. Purple stone tablet, okay. That's what we need. And that's what the sa Saturas or Saturas. Sometimes they say sat Saturas. He needs those. I got it from the first time, but it's empty. Yeah, those guys are quite poor. This is the one of the Undead of the dead, cast of the dead, or something. So the guy is not back. Did he really go? What's that? Bobbly, bobbly tree? What the hell? Uh, no problem. Just go ahead and cross. That I don't believe it. I have to admit, yes, it's a very nice addition, but like for real. And the stone guy, I don't know where he is. Stone sentinel there. I do like the, the tree idea that how to get here, like for real. That's what they should have done and not just this. Sort of jumping around like crazy. Another good bow and bad bow. Up with this. What the hell? Rotting corpse. This looks scary. That looked quite scary. Nice. 
magic arrows, yeah. Sadly, we cannot craft new arrows ourselves. Sadly. That guy looks so weird there. Still burning like crazy. Uh, I think I found something. Lightfish, why would... How did Greg get here? By the way, he's no magician or something. To hide his treasure. Anything important here? Don't believe so, right? Yeah, okay. The rest, as I said, I'm going to come here anyway myself. Oh, a potion was there. You will have to come here later on anyway. Because new monster will spawn in the fourth chapter. Oh, there is a tree. That we simply kicked down. Don't fall down, don't fall down. Nice. So now we can explore up here what could have been and... We have two other mansions to explore. Was here something important? Like another treasure or something? Oh, there is a chest. Ah, there is another chest. Treasure, okay. Normally, from up here, you could jump to the other side if you had the acrobatic. Uh, I think I found some. Probably there are some other ways to get there. But, you know, I've never bothered to with it. Only if I had the acrobatics. Because as I said, uh, there is not a lot of... Ah, we, we opened that already. So now we have to go back where the, we kill the orcs. The two orcs. Because the, the troll we cannot kill here. With the next bow that we have, we might deal some damage. Anything important? The tree? No. Maybe with a summon, but I wouldn't want to waste my stuff on the trolls yet. I mean, sure, they give good experience and stuff, but later on is also time. Do they hear goblins? Ooh, there is a way down here. There is a path. Okay, let's take that path. Let's check the path. It's quite hidden. Yeah, we hear the goblins squeaking about. Somewhere here, but we have to get down there. Yeah, it's quite hidden. I didn't know a long time about that. There are a lot of stuff that I didn't know about, you know, for a very long time. Is it here? Yeah, it's here. And on this version is even harder. Find stuff because, well, more hidden. Thanks to the Laura. Two villains. Nothing to be had there. Yeah, the the villains drop nothing. No weapons, no armor. I mean, no armor, no weapons. Yeah, and no loot. There is a demon. We hear he's snoring. We left three right. Okay. Another apple. Yeah, we'll have to check our. Dexterity stuff, and then we can start mixing strength and the. Oh, sounds like it exploded. Not a lot of loot, but some experience, and we did level up once, soon as I know. Uh, quite far away from the next level up, but we also said that we want one handed. So 20% at least, or. Almost there because we want the one handed. The, the next one, the rookie, or we are rookie now. Yeah, we are rookies now, and then. Oh, rookies under 5%, then is beginner, and then. Something like usable. Good to use the one handed. Or the. Skeletons, as I said in the end game, as a mercenary, we have no access to powerful magic. 
I mean, we do have the scrolls, but not the, the runes that could actually make a huge difference. We will be here again, where we kill the orcs quite in time. Where I believe we are going to make a cut. I'm happy with the progress this time. We did explore two of the the libraries, two of the old buildings of the sleeper of the not the sleeper, sorry, of the builders. And that's where the orcs were. Oh yeah, let's do another one. Are you alone? Holy moly. That's more than perfect. That's a perfect ending for me. So thank you very much guys for joining me. I'll see you in the next episode. Be cool and bye bye.